Take a look at this guy. Happy guy working with documents while staring straight into your soul. The key to success is to never use a stock image like this. This image represents e-commerce perfectly, right? No, it doesn't. It sucks. I'm not going to comment on this one. I hope we, we know where I'm going with this. This is every female customer service agent. This is every male doctor. You wish. And this is working from home. Actually, this one is quite accurate, so I like this one. But for the rest of the images, just don't. The reason is that these images are cringy. They're overused. They don't feel authentic. Um, these are the typical stock photos we see on the top of Google results. And we should really try to avoid these types of images in our presentations because it's very hard to relate to them. So how do you actually choose good images? Well, you should use authentic images, images that feel natural, although they're staged and they're with models, they feel natural. Images that we can relate to um, in our everyday life, whether that's an office setting or you're out in a cafeteria with your friend, whatever it is, is it should feel relatable. Depending on your audience, you should also use funny images. Um, this can be a good way of, of grabbing people's interest and making an impact. Obviously, you have to be careful here on who the audience is. I, I might not use the, the dog with the goggles on a high stakes, uh, important meeting. Abstract images are great. They are great, they are great for uh, reflecting complex topics and other stuff that, that is hard to find images for. Thank you.